Students from the DeKalb Early College Academy, or DECA, as it is called, were pleased to find that their artwork was selected by the interim superintendent, Michael Thurman, to hang in his office. A chance meeting in the rain with art teacher Janine Nichol led to an invitation that Thurman gladly accepted. After meeting the students and being inspired by their talent, Mr. Thurman, a supporter of the arts, asked if he could display the pieces in his office. It's Thurman's goal that the administrative complex plays host to many more pieces of artwork for the students throughout the district. This assignment was called the Critter Pencil Project. Students spent weeks examining grasshoppers, fish, frogs, ants, and dragonflies. They broke the critters down to their basic shapes and created a series of rudimental pencil drawings that exposed the structure of each. Then the students selected the critter that spoke most directly to them and they created larger, more detailed illustrations. Finally, the parts of the critter were replaced by drawings of pencils, then shaded and colored. Look closely. The textures of the critters are actually pencils. See the erasers and pencil points? Thurman planned a premier event for the students as he invited them along with their families and guests to an unveiling at his office. Each student received a certificate for their work as well as a surprise. All right, there's more. A I know, yeah, I need oh. From your superintendent. From Boosters. Oh. All right. Oh. <laughs> 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 You all like Brewster's? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ice cream right. on data, yeah. Well, for great art, you know, there's a price associated yes. with it, right? Yes. Right, right. So that would make me right. a patron, right? Yeah, that's right. I am a patron. All right. No trip to the boss's office would be complete without trying out the big chair. The students took it for a spin as they imagined how they would run the district. Many of Miss Nichols' students are taking their first art class with her, and she says, the creation of art reminds you that you can do whatever you want. For these college-bound students, that reminder will carry them far.